for the question two, we know x is uniform in A and B, and the area, area of this re uh, rectangle is equal to one, and we, after that we know the hat, this one uh, of this rectangle is one divided by B minus A. And after that we know the function uh, f of x, x uh, f of x equal to oh, when x is larger and equal to a smaller and equal to b is equal to 1 divided by b minus a otherwise a0 and for the uh, this function uh, we can know uh, uh, we can um, just do an integral of the f of x and we know that uh before uh when x is smaller than a um is equal to zero and between a and b is equal to x minus a divided by b minus a larger than b is equal to one and for the second one and now given a equal to minus one and uh, b equal to three we need to find and draw f of y and uh, uh, f of y and also found the expectation of y uh, first, first things we plug in uh, we know that uh, f of uh, y of x is y is equal to x square uh, then we know that Y have the uh, y is have the value from zero to nine, and for this, for minus x equal to minus one to one, uh, uh, we need to consider this part for two aspect. First is y larger than one and smaller than uh, larger than zero and smaller than one. Uh, we need to use a function of that uh, f of y is equal to f of x divided by the gradient of uh, gx1 and plus f of x2 um, divided by gx2 uh, and we plug in uh, we know uh, that uh, for this part F of, f of y is equal to 1 minus 4 root of y and for the other part y equal to a uh, y larger than equal to 1 smaller than 9 uh, we use this function and we got the answer uh, equal to 1 divided by 8 uh, root y and when and then we can draw this picture, uh, this, uh, this line for two parts, 0 to 1 and 1 to 9. Uh, you could, mm, and for the uh, big f of y, uh, we can do the integral of the following things. Uh, we, got, mm, we got this true function. And then we can draw the line of this. And uh, for the last one, well, we need to do. We need to know the expectation of y. So we just uh, use a function, uh, use the expectation function, and plug in the number of y. So we got the answer is uh, seven divided by three.